Labour losing women. Yep, once again, Labour losing women is trending on social media. And is it surprising with the compilation of various comments that Labour MPs have made and campaigners have made against the rights of women? One particular one has stood out here. David Lammy said, Those who want to deny males access to women's spaces are dinosaurs who want to hoard rights. But this has all stemmed from a meeting that Sakia Starmer had the other day where he was pictured with a guy called Steve Wardlaw. You can look him up, W-A-R-D-L-A-W, who describes himself as an LGBT-friendly insurer, a champion LG of LGBT+, plus, lat AM dancer, part-time drag queen, trans ally, advisory board. And to make matters worse, at the Labour conference, the LWD, which is the Labour Women's Declaration, in other words, a group of Labour voters who are women, who are trying to protect the rights of women and young girls, have been told they will not be allowed a stall at this year's conference. Many MPs inside the Labour Party, as you can imagine, people like Rosie Duffield, have kicked off about the decision and are baffled as to why they won't be allowed because you can guarantee it'll be full of Palestinian flags, it'll be full of rainbow flags, it'll be full of men trying to get into women's changing rooms and toilets, but apparently in the Labour Party, that's all right. I wouldn't trust Keir Starmer or Labour to tell me if it was raining outside.